hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm tara davis um today i'm gonna film a q a so a couple weeks ago i asked you guys for some questions and i received some questions so i am gonna find them on my phone first first question what do you love about jumping um i honestly don't know um, I like the feeling I get in the air. Um, long jump was my first love in track and field. So, yeah. Um, I just like how fast it is. Not much running, because I don't like running. Um, I like feeling the feeling of flying, I guess. I don't know. It's a good question. Um, do you ever get tired of track? Yes. Sometimes I just want to be a normal person. Sometimes I just want to be able to lay without pain and walk without pain. Um, yeah, I do get tired of track, but I know if I'm not doing track, I'm not going to do anything else. I'm not going to do any other sport. So, yeah. Um, what were your PRs in high school? In long jump, my senior year, it was 22 one i think um in hurdles it was 1283 wind dated 1295 without wind um in triple jump it was like 43 4. what is your major my major is special education these questions are going to like be back and forth with like real questions and track questions um ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. favorite workouts i like bleachers like stadiums and stairs and stuff i like doing those because i started doing those when i was such a, at a young age so i think it's like easier now like to this day and i don't know i just like the feeling of like that burning sensation which you don't to me i don't really get when i'm running unless it's just like lactic acid but that that burning sensation i like um what are your goals for indoor and outdoor this year my goal for indoor is basically just to win NCAAs and long jump and hurdles. Um, it's going to be hard. But I indoor, I hope to hit 22 feet. Last year, I didn't hit 22 feet indoor. I only did outdoor. So hopefully indoor, I can hit that. <laughs> dose, dose. Uh, for hurdles, I hope I can break the um, collegiate record, which is a long shot because it's like 777 or something like that. But I hope I just drop my time, honestly. I hope I can open up with a low eight seconds. Um, I think I opened up last year with like an eight three. So hopefully I can drop that. My favorite fast food has to be either Chick-fil-A or Chipotle. How tall am I and what's your weight? I'm 5'3". And I'm about 119 pounds, 119, 120, um, which is like, I think like 53 kilograms or something like that. I don't know, I'll probably put it like right there. Um, advice for track. I'm hecka nervous. Don't be nervous. Have fun. Um, track is, to me, Personally, this is my personal experience. Track to me is this a getaway drug, I guess. Um, I think of track as fun. I have goals I set for myself. So when I reach those goals, it makes track so much better. Um, it makes track fun. And to fe the feeling of reaching those goals are like insane. Like, it's just like a big check mark on your life, I guess. Um, so... For nerves, just don't even be nervous. Just have fun. Like, yes, I get nervous, but then, like, I think. I'm like, why am I nervous? Like, if I lose, I lose. If I win, I win. I like to have fun. This is my fun thing. Stress reliever, even though it causes me a hell of stress. Stress reliever. So, yeah. How old were you when you started track? By the way, I love you so much. I love you. Um, I started track when I was Four. yeah when I was four and have been doing it ever since 
Wow. What's one place you would want to go? Bora Bora and Fiji. That's all I want to get to. And my life is set. <laughs> what are your worst injuries? My worst injuries? <sighs> um, patella tendinosis and the weird thing I have going on with my back right now. Which I can't even walk right. So that... Would you ever consider coming to Australia? Yeah. Maybe you buy my flight. <laughs> can you speak any other languages if you can say something? I can't, but I, sometimes I make up my own language, you know? Like, I just can't get words out and it just sounds like Tara's language. You know? <laughs> Do you eat unhealthy? How much? I don't know how much I eat unhealthy, but I eat unhealthy every day. What's your biggest dream? Winning the Olympics, like every athlete out there that has an Olympic sport. If you weren't doing track, what sport would you play? Either tennis or cheerleading, but there's not really a professional cheerleading, it's just competition cheer. How many times do you train a week? I train every day. Monday through Saturday. Um, what's my dream pet? Obviously dog. I just want a dog now and no one will let me get a dog. <sighs> Whatever. Do you like wearing your real hair? No. Sometimes? Eh, no. It's so much to handle and I'm not good at hair and, well I'm not good at, I could do hair, I just don't want to put the time and the effort into hair, so I choose not to do it, that makes sense. Um, your skin is 10 out of 10, what products do you use? I use water and a towel. Sometimes I use this Reclaim, let's see if it'll focus, this Reclaim Principal. Um, it's a total facial cleanser, so like it gets all your makeup off, all the dirt and whatnot. Um, my mom actually buys a lot of these and just gives them to me, so I'm not sure. Maybe you can just go to this website, Principal Secret. And as a moisturizer, I use this Glam Glow. Um, I like the smell. It smells really good, and it really moisturizes my face, and then like it gives me like a glowing. Ooh, it smells so good like a glow like a natural glow um it just adds on you know um what else what's your favorite all-time christmas movie the grinch <laughs> okay um what motivates you the most my goals i set for myself so sometimes i write my goals down sometimes i don't sometimes they're just ingrained in my head and it's just like set there um but yeah what do you and hunter love to do together always we love to eat and shop and that's it and sleep what's one thing you hate about hunter i don't hate anything about him he's just stubborn and can't take no for an answer <laughs> love you um, which side did you get your double cartilage piercings? My right. So I have two piercings here and a piercing here and I have my doubles. I wanted to get more but I kind of told my dad I'd stop getting piercings but that's not going to happen. <laughs> Most embarrassing moment. Me falling at Texas Relay. I'll insert a clip now. <laughs> Yeah, that's my most embarrassing moment um, because I was ready for that race. I felt like I was going to, you know, do something big, do something bad. And obviously that didn't happen. I ate it. 
hard. Um, how long does it take to get your bra hair braided? A lot of people ask me that. It takes six hours. What do I do in those six hours, everyone asks. I watch TV. I talk to the lady. I flip through all social media like 20 times in one hour. I, I don't know. I don't... I just sit there and let her braid my scalp. What's the best part about being with Hunter? Um, we're the same person and we have the same interests in life and the same goals. So when you have that type of person in your life, it makes you even more motivated. And he gets me. And a lot of people don't get me, which sucks. But I just have a weird vibe personality type thing to me. And he gets it and i've gone through a lot i guess and he's just very supportive and always there for me and i have not experienced that with anyone else like yes i've experienced that with some friends but like not to this level it's kind of hard to explain but yeah oh shoot um my birthday is may 20th i was born in 1999 uh, how do you stay positive after a bad race? Okay, so I've had plenty of bad races, plenty of bad jumps. Um, yes, you feel down in the moment, but then you look back to it and it's like, oh, that was just one meet. I had one meet where, I think it was, it was SEC's Outdoor in Tampa, I think, and in every single event, I did not make finals. In my 4x1, I got our team disqualified. Um, it was honestly the worst me of my entire life. I let it get to my head, but then I realized, like, I took a step back, like, out of me, like, literally, could, like, took a step back out of my body, and was like, this me doesn't matter. Like, it's one me, and if you don't want to feel like that anymore, put the more effort in. I just told myself, it doesn't matter. It's one me. You have another me coming up. Bring that A game. Bring your shit. To that me and that's what I did YOLO I'm gonna do like two more questions because I have to go um where do you guys plan on living in the future I want to live in Texas and I think Hunter wants to also so I think that's where we're gonna live <laughs> and one more question I like this one what was your first reaction when you met his parents they were the sweetest people I've ever met in my life. They are so nice, so thoughtful, so amazing. Like, Barb, Steve, I love you guys. If you're watching this video, I'm thankful for you guys. And I'm just so blessed to have you guys in my life. I love you guys so much. And yeah, see you at Christmas or something. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe, like, and turn my notification bell on so you know when I'm posting more videos because I'm going to try to post more videos. Um, I am going to Monaco on basically like this weekend. I want this video out on Friday. I'm going to try. Um, yeah, so I'm going to Monaco on Friday and I'm going to be vlogging my whole experience. I'm not sure if I should vlog day one, day two, um, but it's going to be amazing. I'm getting a world record um, award, so that's freaking awesome, and yeah, that's it. Thank you guys again for watching. See you next time.